So as we know, big game at Hamden this Sunday, as is often the case when big games come around for Celtic, we, we don't have a shortage of injury problems. Yep. number of them um, in recent weeks. Um, funnily enough, Rangers haven't had too many, I don't think. But I know, but I'm sure they'll find something to complain about. <laughs> but um, yeah, t- two kind of main positions we want to talk about. The first one, uh, left back. Yeah. It's really bizarre position because you're probably you know, shouting at the whatever your computer screen or whatever at the moment saying Greg Taylor but Greg Taylor can't play can't play uh, thank you Kilmarnock played in a game for Kilmarnock against Hamilton earlier this season so he's cup tied for the final which means we're down to um, either volleyball and goalie who we understand this could change but we understand he isn't going to make the game Mm -hmm. or Johnny Hayes who probably will make Mm -hmm. the game so the question is is it Hayes um, that we're going to play at left back and are we okay with that I think it's going to have to be his. I mean, if Taylor was eligible, I think he'd play for sure. Yeah. As we say, Bowen goes by a doubt. Uh, I think it'll be his unless we decide to move to three to back, and I just can't see, can't see that for that a cup is. final. It would be too much of a risk, and I don't think Lenny would think of that. No, the elephant in the room is Callum McGregor. No, no, no. I mean, what happened? I've still got flashbacks uh, when we played Aberdeen in the cup final at Hamden. He was left back when Tierney. Uh, broke his nose aye. and like he, he fell over goal. the ball aye, and Aberdeen had that chance Johnny Hayes uh, what's Johnny Hayes yeah. but let me make up for an answer <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but uh, no I think it'll be Hayes and it'll be his biggest test probably bigger than Lazio if you think about it because Lazio well, let's be honest one of the really expecting to win before it'd be back to the wall this game we probably do expect to win I'd say the one thing I would say about Hayes and the left back issue is I'd be more worried if it was right back we had Aye, a, a, mm-hmm, a nightmare mm-hmm. I think there's two players for me we have to watch on Sunday mm-hmm. one of them's the obvious one no matter what folks say I don't really particularly like the guy but mm-hmm. I think he's a he's a good goal scorer Morelos um, and Ryan Kent as well who yep. um, I don't think he's a great footballer I think he's a, ha- a half decent footballer but he's a player who has caused us problems in the back yep. I think when we had a poorer right back oh, I think he'll, mm-hmm. he'll struggle more now but if you know if it was a problem at right back, it'd be more worried oh, about that. Be, yeah. but, but their right wing probably is it Ojo or someone like that. Aye. I wouldn't be as worried about him. No, um, it'll still be a test for his, but I mean, really, there's no other option. And it's, it's almost good now that he's played. Aye, that that, that was Stadio smart. Limpo. Really, maybe that was what Lennon was thinking about all along. It might be because we would have known by then how Always. severe Boy's injury was, and obviously Taylor can't play so. Maybe that was smart management. Because you would feel less worried now. I don't feel worried about Hayes at all. No, if he'd have gone in after you know not playing left back. Aye, at if, all. if it if it was getting cold and not played it at all, then everybody'd be like panic stations. Yeah, but no, he should be okay. Yeah. Aye. In terms of striker, that's the other yes. issue. Um, Odson Edward. I think he's probably fifty fifty at the moment. I was hearing murmurings earlier that um he wasn't going to make the Aye. game, but I've I've heard equal murmurings that he, he will be fit. So. That's an interesting one. If if he's not fit, who do you want? But but more so, who do you think Lennon will go with? Uh, this one I'm genuinely unsure about. I mean, I don't think he'll start Griffiths. No. No. no I, I, th- think I think it'll be Morgan. I think it'll be Morgan as well. Which, uh, <laughs> it's remarkable, isn't it? It's just weird. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know. Because it's Rangers, I think Eddie might play. I think if it was like... Aberdeen or Hearts or Kelly or somebody, I think we wouldn't risk him. Yeah. And I know we've got big league games after it, but we've got players, we've got like Griffiths, and then that, that would pro- probably start the league games. But I mean, I don't know, do you think he'll start Eddie? Well, if, if Edwards. If he's 50 50, do you think he'd start him? Not 50 50. I think if he was, you know, 80 20, something like that, I think he'd start him. But I don't think you can afford, as good as Edward is, I don't think you can afford a, you know, a half fit player in a game of that. I know, know I mean, I'm just. Nature. I know he gives you that bit of quality, but mm-hmm. if he's not played in three or four games at that stage and he isn't fully fit, I don't think you can risk him. I don't know, man. Morgan's done well, but that was against yeah. a, a rain team that sort of gave up the ghost. And he'd done well, I think, against Ross County, especially for that third goal. But, I mean, this would be just a, a different story altogether. I mean, I think he'd probably start as well if it's no Eddie. Unless we do something like, I don't know, play Rohit or Christie's a false nah. nine, which would be weird, but that wouldn't work. Can I see that? No, I mean, this will probably be the big dilemma. If it'll be, like, crossing off angles that Eddie starts. And if yeah. it's no Eddie, everybody will go into Milton. But, I mean, if Lenny believes that Morgan will do the job... 
so be it. You've done well against Ryan, and mm. if he thinks, you never know. The, all, the Derby's a funny game. There's been unexpected heroes before. Maybe it's true. Morgan it's a to, aye, to write your own legacy. He'll become a, a legend overnight. You worried? No, I will be in Sunday, but no, no. What's your prediction? A Celtic victory, but I'm not saying the score. Right? Don't do predictions for no, no, I think we win, but I've been burned by making predictions before. I think you had a, was it a Rangers win the last time, was it a draw? I said it'd be a draw, nah. but I said we'd beat Hibs, and uh, we never beat them. So. Right. Well, I'm going for. Okay, I've not even thought about that. I'm going to go for. <laughs> I'm going to go for 3 1 Celtic. I think it's got a 3 1 uh, ring to it. Ranger, th- Rangers maybe scoring first, but 3 1 Celtic. I don't know. I think, it, I think it might go extra time, which I'm not really. Penalties. Oof. No thanks. Get previous kind of memories of that against uh, them. I know. Right, well, hopefully, no extra time or penalties needed, but if they are and Celtic win, then I don't think too many of us will be complaining. Um, let us know your predictions, where you'll be watching the game, how you think it'll go, etc., in the comments below.